besties, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to do my overnight heatless beachy waves. This has been my go-to for a while now, so I know that it is tried and true and will leave you with the perfect beachy wave look. Starting off, I just got out of the shower. What I've been using lately for shampoo and conditioner, I've been switching off a lot lately. Recently, I've been using the Colorwell shampoo and conditioner and I've been really loving these lately, especially because I have highlights in my hair if you color your hair. I feel like this is really good for like protecting your hair and making sure like if you have color treated hair that it's nice and healthy. And this also has no sulfates and it leaves like no residues, which is very important. So I've been loving using the Colorwell shampoo and conditioner recently and then to kind of detangle my hair before I brush it out because I feel like it can be really harsh when I'm trying to just brush it right away. So I like to put a product in just to help it brush easier. So lately I've been using the Ava Hair NYC Main Magic 10 in 1 Primer for fine hair and I just spray this on and then I brush my hair. Because I feel like this just kind of helps detangle the strands and make it easier for me to brush it. And this also smells really good. And I have to say, Ava Hair NYC, like, their packaging is just so cute for all their products. I have a couple of their products. And the packaging, like, they win. They win as far as packaging because it's just so cute. Like, all the different colors. I'm just obsessed with their packaging. I kind of go crazy with it. I usually brush my hair with, like, a wide tooth comb, but I cannot find it for the life of me. So we're just going to use this brush. And I always start at the ends and then work my way up. Because I heard it's healthier for your hair, you don't like damage it as much. Because I've always heard like it's just easier to brush your hair starting from the ends and working your way up. You get like less tangles and knots and stuff. I have my comfy robe on. I love being a robe girly after you get out of the shower and just like, there's just no feeling like it. Like after you get out of the shower, you take an everything shower, you moisturize your body and you put a cute little robe on. There's just nothing like it. This one is from the OD. I think I showed it in a different video, but it has like little coffees on it. I just think it's so cute. I think I'm also gonna go in with this just for funsies. This is a lift off volumizing and thickening mist. So you just like spray it focusing on your roots and I guess it like just helps add more volume. So love that. So after I've kind of loosely found where I part my hair, I will go in with the essential product of this video is I've been using the Function of Beauty Straight and Wavy Hair Bond Oh my god, this is the wrong product. So this is the wrong product. I have to get the other one. But this I will also use as well. And this is the Straight and Wavy Hair Bonding Leave-In Treatment. And it just helps, like, bond the hair follicles. And just, like, it's essential for healthy and shiny and gorgeous-looking hair. So I'm actually going to use a little bit before we do the wavy hair mousse. And I just kind of rub it on my fingers and then target more towards the ends of my hair and then work it up a little bit. I'm not going to go crazy with this, but I do want... My hair looking good because I feel like whenever you're air drying your hair, it's just essential to use like a lot of products so it doesn't like look frizzy and like I just feel like products make the world of a difference when you're air drying your hair. So love using these. So let me go get the mousse because I forgot it. And I will say I also really like the function of beauty packaging. Like I love when products have like different colors and they just make like fun packaging. So this is the essential product that you need if you're gonna follow this routine. I feel like I would recommend all of these products, but if you're just gonna go with one, I definitely recommend the Function of Beauty Wavy Hair Zero Gravity Styling Mousse. I really, really love this and I feel like every time I've used this when doing like a beachy wave or like an air dry wavy look, it just like makes the world of a difference. So highly recommend this one but we're just gonna go in. Also, this is not sponsored. I'm just sharing the products that I love and use all the time. So I'm gonna shake it up and then do a couple pumps starting from the roots of my head and then down to my ends. I just do like three pumps to start out. Just kind of distribute the product. I kind of just rub it in. And next, we're gonna just scrunch everything up. I don't even know how you scrunch properly, but I just kind of grab everything and like go up and I scrunch it. And I just keep doing this over and over again for a bit. It's a little time consuming, but I feel like this is like the most important part. Also, if you feel like you put a little too much product in this step, you can always scrunch your hair with the towel too, and that'll take like the excess product off, I guess. So at this point, after I've scrunched it up, I'm just gonna leave it and let it air dry for a couple hours, maybe like maybe like an hour or so, and then I'll pop back in and show you guys what I do next. So yeah, I'm just gonna do other things, let it air dry, and then come back to it. Okay, so I'm back. It's been about an hour, and my hair is almost fully dried. So this is how it air dried with the products in. So like kind of wavy, kind of not. So what I do at this point is I'll usually do two braids and then sleep in them. And then by the time I wake up, it'll be nice and wavy and the waves will hold and it'll be good. Get up into three sections and then I go under with the strands and then I grab a little piece and I go under and then I just continue that throughout my whole head.
the same exact thing on the other side. sleep with them overnight and then I'll check back in tomorrow morning and take them out. Hey guys, so it's the next day now, so I'm gonna take these braids out and see how pieces are too straight so I think I might curl the ends a little bit yeah I think the waves came out good I just definitely should have braided more towards the end of my hair and I feel like it would have been perfect so I'm just gonna go in with a curling iron and then kind of touch up the end pieces down some hairspray i'm using the tresemme ultra fine hairspray so for a fully heatless look like definitely braid all the way down to your ends i don't know why i did it but it will help complete the look but at least if you do have to touch up a few pieces you're only using a little bit of heat so i love this look love how it came out and it's definitely a go-to heatless hairstyle for the lazy days where i just want to wake up and be ready to go this is a perfect go-to look so i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll catch you in the next one love ya bye